They've lived in the same home for the last 38 years, but now a Port Ritchie couple says they're afraid to leave their house, all because of what's happening next door. So Larry and Margaret de Blasi called on our Taking Action reporter, Jackie Calloway, for help. I just start out with beads like this. Beady necklaces, Beady normally man. a fun pastime for Margaret de Blasi. But she made more than a few this summer out of fear of what lay in wait outside her front door. Just to make something, just for the sake of doing something in the house <laughs> when you're stuck in the house for six weeks. For six weeks, Margaret rarely ventured outside thanks to the neighbors that took up residence at the foreclosed home next door. The main thing was my grandchildren. Four of her five grandbabies are allergic to bee stings, which means all visits to grandma's house stopped this summer. They told me that they would take care of it. Larry de Blasi says he made repeated calls to the company that maintains the home for the bank. This went on for weeks and weeks and weeks and almost called every week. The property manager told the de Blasi's they were working on it, but the hive and its hundreds of bees remained. I did a quick online search and that led us to the owner of the home, Citibank. I emailed their corporate office and they quickly responded. And the next day there was beekeeper at the house. <laughs> That's how fast it went. And so for the first time in weeks, Margaret and Larry wander in and out of their yard at will. The best part? The children and grandchildren returned for their weekly visits to grandma's. It really helped us out and made me a happy grandma. Citibank tells us they were well into the process of hiring a specialist to take care of those bees when we contacted them. Either way, we're just glad the de Blasi's got some relief. I'm Jackie Calloway taking action for you.